Welcome back guys to a brand new video and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can make loads of money in a very short amount of time so let's get straight into this all right guys so um i just got in game here so i'm in my ship already i got um everything prepared so basically what i suggest to you guys is have some sort of cargo ship the more amount of scu you can carry the more money you will make from this so i am using the c2 bomber which is a um very big cargo ship and i believe it can carry the most cargo uh in the game right now um, and it's we're in the update of 3.19.1. So uh, in 3.20, there's going to be the whole C, which is obviously going to be obviously going to be able to carry more than the C2. So once you get here, we are at Crusader. Uh, sorry, not Crusader. We are at Hurston. Once you get to Hurston, the first thing um, you're going to want to do is we're going to want to head over to Ariel because one of the big things that they have there is Laronite, and uh, Laronite sells for a lot. Now, sometimes they won't have any, so then it just kind of becomes a, a little bit of a waste of time, but it's always beneficial to check as if you can find some, it'll sell, and it'll sell for a good profit. So, I'll see you guys when I get there. Now, there's two places on this moon that I would suggest going to, one of them being um, HDMS, um, I don't know how to pronounce that, but you guys can see it on screen there. Um, I would suggest going to this one and the other HDMS as they both carry Laronite. So I'm going to go ahead and jump all the way over to this HGMS and I'll see you guys when I get very close to it. All right, guys. So we're about like seven clicks out now. So we're getting pretty close. Um, this, this game just looks amazing. Anytime I go into F4, it just looks so good. So we're going to start to uh, slow down right here because we are getting closer. So I'm going to take it off cruise control. All right. We're about two clicks out now. And what I'm going to do is go ahead and activate my landing gear we're going to be landing now i believe you don't need to land at one of these pads you just have to land somewhere close but for the sake of this video i'm just going to land at a pad just so we get no issues hopefully and here we go let's go ahead and land this thing i, I always have trouble landing this thing because it always like moves all right there we go i'm gonna turn my engine off just like that and let's go ahead and exit the ship all right guys we're in the elevator here we are leaving the ship as you can see that's the cargo bay right there so that thing's gonna be filled by the end of this video so let's go ahead we're gonna exit the ship so what we're gonna be looking for is a place that says storage on it as we can see a little caliper over there um so yeah that's that's another good uh, cargo ship but we're gonna look for the place that says storage on top as that's the only one we can use so like there'll be some that says like mining control habitation but we're looking for the one that says storage so let's go ahead and enter um, inside here all right here we go and also inside it you can see there's like loot crates here if you need um, and if you see the red ones definitely loot those as those carry armor so let's go ahead and select your ship so you're gonna click this thing up here on the top left where it says your inventory you're gonna select that and then you're gonna select your ship so obviously we have the crusader c2 hercules starlifter and unfortunately laronite someone already bought but if you're here and it says it up here definitely buy that and as buy as much as you can as um, it's going to give you the most amount of profit. Now it is expensive, um, but it is definitely worth it. And I started with, I think I was at like a hundred K like maybe last week. And I'm already at, let's see, let's see. I am at 5.6 mil. So it really, and I, and I haven't been grinding it that much. So it really does not take that long. Oops. I don't know why that just opened. Um, it really does not take that long. You just got to do some, it, it is a little bit of boring gameplay, I will admit, but it makes the money, so that's all that matters. So, I'm not going to go ahead and check out the other place, um, but I will show you guys on the map so you guys can check it out. Uh, so, it is, if you go here, you go to Ariel, it is um, HDMS Lathan, don't know if I said that correctly, but that place. So, those two places on Ariel are going to be your best um, Laronite place. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and go up all the way back to our pilot seat. And I'm gonna show you guys the other way of getting money easily, which is the same concept, really just we're buying something else at a different moon. And it doesn't really ever go out of stock. And if it does, well, that's, I think that's very shocking because I think it's almost unlimited. But I could be wrong. I, I'm kind of new to this trading thing, so I could be wrong. But let's go ahead and fly there and uh, get out of this planet now if let's say you bought laronite and it filled up your ship 
what you're gonna want to do as there's might be people coming here to get your lair knight like pirates so first we want to do a quick scan here and um it looks like there's a red now this looks to be a um ai thankfully but let's say it wasn't what you want to do is press f6 as that is going to turn all your power to your boost so once you do that set a destination um before you leave i'm not because there's no one here and then what you're gonna do is look straight up and hold down shift and exit as quickly as you can all right guys so we just left so now what we're gonna do is set a course to eta i think i said that right i don't know um so we can you can either go to um hdms woodruff or hdms rider doesn't matter they both have what we're looking for so let's go ahead and go ahead and quantum jump over there and i'll see you guys when i get there all right guys we just arrived so let's go ahead and fly all the way to hdms woodruff and what we're going to be buying here is also what makes money pretty pretty good but not as much as laranite this is the top two thing i would definitely buy and let's say you filled up on laranite but you can still fill up more come over here and uh get some of this material that we're going to be getting over here and then i'm going to be showing you guys where to sell it because you don't want to just keep it because again if you like um some if you get killed then you're gonna lose all this precious cargo and it's not cheap let me tell you that so you don't want to lose it and also if you don't have enough money for it start on the littler things and then as you build up then start buying more and more of the more expensive stuff and uh yeah so let's go ahead and fly all the way here let's go ahead and see how this looks this just looks so cool guys um so yeah, let's go ahead and fly here. Let's see what we got over here. We have another Drake Caterpillar. People are littering littering these Caterpillars everywhere. All right, let's go ahead and slow down. Activate our landing gear. Pull up a little bit so we don't crash. All right, and it is this place, which isn't loading in, I think. Yeah, it's this place. Okay, there we go. There's our pad. So we're going to go ahead and land at this pad. Again, Caterpillars taking up the larger pad, so can't land there but we could definitely hope i think we'll be able to fit here it's gonna be a close one but i think we'll fit and let's see will we fit yes we wait hold up all right guys and again look for the place that says storage looks like there's some wind picking up here so we're gonna have to be a little careful because this game likes to throw you on the ground and then uh you you die so you just gotta be careful of that i think this is storage let's just check yep that's storage all right let's go ahead and jump i think that's gonna be our fastest way in there because this wind is so strong. <laughs> I think this wind just picked up too. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and open the door. We're gonna pressurize this so this um, we can get some oxygen going. All right, and uh, here we go. So you're gonna go over to this console. You're gonna hold down F, you're gonna use it. Then you're gonna go ahead and select your inventory like I showed you guys with the Lair Knight. And you're gonna see this thing called Barrel. Now you're gonna see this and you, you can click this right arrow to buy the maximum amount you can. So we're gonna buy 1.6 million worth. So it's quite a, quite expensive, but it is gonna be worth it in the end. So we're gonna go ahead and buy that. Okay. There we go. We're gonna boost out so we get, a, get out of here quickly because again, this is quite expensive cargo. And I forgot to mention, you don't need to worry about 30 Ks anymore, which is a crash for those of you guys who don't know. You won't lose the cargo, the ship will automatically store into your home planet so uh whatever wherever that is for me it's area 18 but for you if it's like hurston or if it's crusader it'll, it will store there with all of the cargo so don't freak out if it crashes right, guys so we just arrived so if if it looks like you can't see anything what i suggest you guys is pressing tab as it will do a scan and you'll be able to see and what we're looking for is you'll see this big big building right there and you want to go in front of it because that's where the landing pads are. So you can see the sign kind of down there. Tease the spaceport. That's where we're trying to go. So we are going to boost all the way down there. This is a safe zone. So you don't need to be in a rush. But for the sake of this. I'm going a little bit fast here. Um, so we are almost there. And as soon as it pops up that you can uh, request a landing. Just like that. You're going to go ahead and request your landing. Whatever your hotkey is. Or you can call it um, manually. Alright, so we see our little landing pad just here. So we're gonna go ahead and land over here. So it's hard to see it. Okay, it's kinda dark, but I think I see where we're going now. Yep, right here. So we're gonna go ahead and put out our landing gear and our VTOL as that helps 
me land, I think. I could be wrong on that, but that's what I believe it does. And we're just going to wait for these doors to open because uh, we don't want to crash and blow up. Because then our cargo will be gone and uh, that will stink. But we're going to go ahead and land here. So we're going to go down nice and gentle. And there we go. It's so much easier to land here than on planets. Alright, turn off our engines. And exit our seat. Sell it. So we're going to head and go over to these little panels over here. And we're going to sell it. Or not sell it, sorry, store it. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and press store, just like that. And then you can go ahead and go away from there. And then if you follow me, we're gonna go ahead and sell it. So you're gonna go this way, um, as you would to the tram. And then you're gonna go, in a second here, um, we're gonna go, instead of going to the right, which is where everything is, we're gonna go this way, to the green sign. Follow the green sign. We're gonna go through these gateways and hopefully get on this train don't leave without me please okay there we go sometimes it could take a minute to get here but um it's not too bad because we're about to make a lot of money so i think we were at 5.6 uh, million when we checked so right now we're at 4 million because we bought um a lot so once we sell this we should be back over 5.6 million i if, if my estimations are correct we should be at 5.8 because for each run you do, I think it's about 200k. And if you add Laronite onto that, it's like bonuses. So you'll be making so, so much more. All right, guys, so we just arrived here. We're gonna go ahead and exit, and you're gonna go straight up to this building. And these statues just look so cool too. I love these statues. I'm so glad that they uh, revamped Lorville because it just looks so much better. So you're gonna see all these NPCs, you know, just ignore them. They're not gonna harm you. So we're gonna go ahead and go up these stairs here. And this is the part where, if you're unsure of, um, watch carefully. So we're going to go ahead, right through the entrance, make a, uh, go up these staircases, make a left at this entrance, the transfers, and then we're going to go right down these stairs here. Alright, there we go. And then we are going to make, you could either go to the right side or left, but I think the left side is a lot faster in my opinion. I don't think it matters though. And then you're going to go ahead and press use. You're gonna go ahead and select your ship. Uh, click the cell thing on the right. Click your uh, Laronite or barrel. You're gonna go ahead and drag it all the way to the end and we're gonna sell it. So guys, as you can see right here, it's not selling for a lot. We're only getting 500K while we paid 1.6 million. And that is because I just realized if we look over here, we can see the barrel says very high inventory. So meaning that they're they're really not, uh, they really don't want the barrel. So. Um, I've never had that happen to me, so for you. Alright guys, so uh, I waited uh, like, I would say 5 minutes, and uh, there it is. It's back to 1.8 million, so that means we're going to be getting around uh, 200,000 profit. So let's go ahead and select this inventory, here we go. Um, Alright, and we're going to put it on the sell tab right here, and 1.86. And confirm, and then it's going to process for like, should take like 30 seconds. And then we're going to press accept. And then we're gonna be rich. So here we go. We're just waiting for this process. And any second now. Star citizen, please. Alright, there we go. So we're gonna press accept, walk out of here. And if we press F1, there we go. We were at 5.6, now we're at 5.8. And we just made a easy 200k. And it took maybe what, like 20, 20, 30 minutes. So yeah, it took took a little bit of time but also I was explaining so sometimes that can add a few minutes onto that but sometimes I could run it in about 10 minutes or less and uh, yeah so it's pretty pretty good profit now if it said what it said just wait a little bit and it should be good and I think that's just about it so if you guys have any questions or concerns let me know down in the comment section below but that is gonna be it for this video so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one peace